Well, I'm going to do a little city limits fishing today. I actually plan on hitting another stretch of river here, so I'm only going to be out on this part for a couple hours. But I had a pretty good feeling I can get a handful of smallies in that time. It is 7.50 a.m. right now. I'm going to shoot for five nice smallies by 9.50. We'll give it two hours. And by nice smallies, we'll say 17 inches or better. Well, the clock is ticking. Let's go catch them. Good one. Oh, well, that is a big smallie. Did you stay on, girl. Man, she is a toad. Here in the middle of the city. Jeez. Please stay on. Oh my gosh. That is the biggest smiley I've caught in a long time. That is a monster smallmouth. She is 21 inches on the dot. That is one of the fattest smallmouth I've ever seen. Jeez. camera into picture mode for just a second get a couple pics of this big girl and we'll go back into video mode for the release well there's one more look at her I'm gonna send her on her way Jeez, that is a fat small girl ready to go off she goes Well, there's number one, 17 or better. I will take that. Time do we start? 7.50. Took us all of about 20 minutes to catch that one.
I'd say we're off to a pretty good start. Seventeen and a quarter. We'll count that as fish number two. stays on there. Yeah, there's still a fish on there. She might be foul hooked. I don't know if we can count that or not. Oh, she just shook it too. Darn it. That's so weak. She was follow hooked anyways, but that was a good fish. Hopefully she's got a friend over there. So we're running out of time. We got like 45 minutes. Got three fish to catch. So. chasing her too. Just have one jump up into my boat there. Oh dude, I just oh that's two for one. Dude. That is two fish. That one just swam right into my net. Oh she is giving me a bath too. Jeez. The one that just jumped up into my net is big. Never had that happen. One was chasing my hooked one up, put my net down to net her, and the second one jumped right in with her. I guess we can count that as fish number three and four. Water for just a second. Get a measurement on this one. 
Oh no, she's too small. So this is the one that I hooked. This is the one that jumped into my net. Can you believe that? Look at that thing. Yeah, I'll take this one. She is 20. Right on the money. One of the craziest 20s I've ever caught. I'll take it. That is fish number three over 17 inches. That was crazy. Geez, that one had like four nice ones chase her up there. It really doesn't surprise me that just happened, but I was not expecting that. Never even really considered it a possibility. <laughs> She just really wanted that spook, I think. That's what it was. She chased that spook all the way into the net. Whoa. Oh, you stay away from that stick. Get off of that stick. for her to swim into either. Jeez. She's got two more just absolute giants chasing her too. Yeah, that one will be 17 or better. Jeez, that might be another 20 plus. Another fatty on that spook. I know she's 17, we're gonna see if she's 20. Nope, 19 and an eighth. Another nice fish though. Jeez, we're catching some, some piggies out here today. That was number four, I've got five minutes to get number five. I can do it. No. that fat chunk. An absolute giant. Kind of got that hook to the gill plate. I'm sure she had one in her mouth though. Let's see what time it is. Oh, I'm three minutes too late. 
three minutes past my goal. Although we're gonna still consider this a success, I think, because it probably took me three minutes to launch. I've only been on the water for two hours. And that is number five. And that one is definitely over 17 inches. Jesus. This is super fatty. 19 and three quarters. Oh, almost 20. Oh, she might be 20. She's like an eighth inch shy of 20. Jeez. Well, that's number five. And that's my city limit. Good morning fishing. Good morning to fish them though. Whether or not I met the goals that I set for myself. Quite lofty I might add. I still gotta consider this a successful morning. You know, are you kidding me? The size of those fish that we were catching. I'm getting them all on top water too. Man, that is just the icing on the cake. I almost hate to leave this stretch of river, but we got plans to go try out another spot today. Do a little wacky rig fishing and try some modifications I made to my power pole. So I'm gonna go do that. Might have to come back and fish this stretch again this weekend though. I had a blast. That was awesome. There's some huge smallies out here too. I hope you guys enjoy the video. Catch you later.